So hey y'all, so if you were watching my other video, you guys know I got a phone call and I ended the video. So this is me finishing my phone call. I know you guys are like, girl, really? And y'all, really? Um, I was kiki and high and all of that and the like as I was on the camera. I was supposed to be cleaning up, but I just got carried away. You know, my conversations are lit. So I'm drinking my, my iced coffee right now. Then I'm also going to bring you guys on a quick clean, not really clean with me, but put up my dishes and then I'm going to come back after I put up my dishes and I'm going to talk to you guys because I did tell you guys that I was going to make another video. Um, so I'm about to pretty much let you guys go in right now and watch me clean after I get, I mean, watch me put away my dishes after I get off the phone. So yeah, it's laughter is good for the soul. So make sure you have some good friends. Make sure you have some good people in your life that makes you laugh. Because if no one makes you laugh, then you need to find some new people to be in your hey, life. Hey y'all. So, so it's Curly Keep Victoria. on watching. I am back with another video. Remember I told you guys I was going to come back with another video. Sorry, I'm not liking... I'm really not liking that angle. Sorry. I have you guys propped up on my... I think that's a little better. What do y'all think? Because I'm just going to really stand right here and talk to y'all. So I just told you guys that I was going to, um, let me get this out of the way because it's going to bother me if it's sitting in the corner right there. So basically I just told you guys that I am going to talk to you guys about what's going to be going on in my life, what I have going on, what I'm doing. So I've already washed my dishes as you guys can see in the background. Some of them are still sitting in the sink because they're drying. I just washed some fresh dishes. I had a nice luscious salad. And I had some green drink, and I'm about to drink the rest of my green juice right now. So this is what my green juice is looking like that I'm about to drink right now, if the camera would focus on me. But this is a green drink I'm about to be drinking, y'all. Um, and I'm just going to finish it off. I need to, it has basically kale leaves, cucumber, celery stock, lemons, green apples, mint leaves, spinach leaves. So if you need like a pressed cold drink and you didn't make it, definitely try um this i don't know who carries it i know my mom and pop like farmer's market carry it but i don't know if other ones carry it. you can make this at home too but if you just didn't make it it's just i'm gonna use the starbucks cup that i have my iced coffee in for now and i'm just gonna actually i'm gonna drink the rest of this y'all it looks like it's a lot of everything on the bottom of this I want to get all my greens in. I've already had like probably like three bowel movements already today. Yeah, like three. I'm sure by the time I go to sleep, I probably will have a fourth. Um, I've been green all day. So pretty much earlier I had a green smoothie. I y'all, I mean I'm not even making this up. I just thought about this. I had a green smoothie today, um, like a detox smoothie. I had a vegan like wrap or a chicken wrap vegan um with lettuce tomato like vegetables in there and then i had a iced coffee sugar-free vanilla and then obviously hot water during the day i got home and i actually had two servings of a salad and now i'm drinking the rest of this green juice that i had started drinking earlier i had a cup of that and now i'm actually drinking the remainder by the time I go to sleep tonight I'm gonna be drinking more water but I don't really see myself eating much if I do I might eat an apple or something stick to greens but I've been needing to detox my body and just and this is just like doing it between the coffee the green smoothies I'm trying to detoxify because that that actually brings me to the point in which we were talking about um like what I'm gonna be up to what I'm doing sorry y'all Kind of just um so pretty much i'm going to be um really just trying to clean my body i have my cycle is coming up very soon you guys know i get very sick if you don't know you know now i get really sick a lot of times and i have to try to get my greens in days or weeks before even though i have salads i eat greens i drink greens when I know that I'm creeping up on my cycle, I have to really go in with the greens because your girl be sick, okay? But this helps with the iron levels. This helps with the nutrients, everything. So that's why I'm saying this green drink has so many nutrients in here. 
plus I already had salad, plus I had a healthy wrap. Like I had a lot of healthy stuff today and I'll be drinking more water today. I did have my probiotic this morning. Um, I need to start taking, I have bought some more vitamins. One second, y'all. I have forgot that I have bought these vitamins some time ago. They're hair, skin, and nail, and they're argan oil infused. And I, I haven't popped this one open because I had ran out of my other, I got these vegan vitamins that I guess they stopped making them or I just, they've been selling out. So I decided to pick up some different ones. This is what I picked up. Um, and again, like I said, good for your hair, skin, and nails. It has everything in here. So just in case you're wondering, it's Nature Bounty, which this brand is excellent. They have a lot of different supply of things, but health and beauty with biotin, um, antioxidant C and E, hyaluronic acid, extra strength, optimal solution, argan oil infused. So you already know your girl is. Oh, I've never seen capsules this color. Wait a minute. These look fancy, honey. Wait a minute. Oh, excuse me. Have y'all seen these capsules yet? Look at these. They're like a metallic pink. Now y'all got me nervous. Like, what am I putting in my mouth if it's like metallic? Anyhow. Taking one of these. Since I just ate, I think that would have been a perfect time to take it. But I need to start taking these again. My vitamins in in the morning when I take my probiotic but anyway yeah so the goal right now is to lose this additional weight get my belly back flat um, tone up my body sculpt my body all those things you guys know that I'm doing I'm working on business I'm working on school I'm working on a lot of things rebranding blase blase so like I said I'm really gonna just be focused on what I'm putting in my body you guys know I eat vegan so I know it's easy to think, oh, well, you're already healthy. Well, yes and no, because it's like, as a vegan, you still have very, you know, you have options that aren't the best, but you also have good options. So I want to cut back on soy products. I don't eat them every day, but when I'm making my vegan boils and I'm making vegan spaghetti and stuff like that, I do contain soy. Um, right now, the focus is getting the food in my refrigerator out and in my freezer. Like I have, I was supposed to make broccoli asparagus i was supposed to make like a broth um i do have some salad that basically the expiration date just passed or the best used date by just passed but y'all for real for real i know it said best used by this date but i'm gonna be using that anyway tomorrow i'm gonna test it i'm gonna taste it i'm not gonna make it as a salad but i am gonna use that baby spinach to make me a pro like a green smoothie i'm gonna take lots of it so hopefully i can finish that up between today and or tomorrow and the next day i know like i said it's at best used by but your girl is still going to use it because if i get sick then y'all y'all can witness what happened but <laughs> i'm just tired of wasting food and i'm tired of things like that but like i said if i get to it tomorrow and it tastes like it's expired i'm not going to use it obviously i'm not going to blatantly be sick but if it tastes fine instead of eating it in the form of a salad i'm going to just put it in a smoothie so i'll probably make a a green smoothie tomorrow I've now finished my green drink here I'm drinking it here um, I still have the kombucha so I still have this I did pre make me a matcha for tomorrow so I made my matcha with almond mil or oat milk so it's a matcha right here I didn't put any ice in my matcha Matchas can be darker depending on how much um, almond milk or oat milk you put in here. Um, but tomorrow all I have to do is basically get ice and fill it all the way to the top. And we will be matcha friendly. Matcha friendly sis. So yeah. That was top notch aggravating what I just did. But. Oh. Uh, Y'all. So. I know this is like all over the place. But. I bought this kimchi from Target and I normally don't grocery shop in Target. I was just in there trying to grab some quick like salad because I wanted a salad that day and I didn't want to go to the grocery, full grocery store so I just grabbed some salad and I saw this gluten free kimchi, vegan kimchi. Um, I've heard of the, the, the Seoul brand, 
However, I've not tried the kimchi. And if you guys know anything about kimchi, kimchi is definitely like a probiotic. It gives a probiotic effect. I first had kimchi when I was young. Um, there was this Vietnamese family who also happened to do my family's nails. And we were really close with them. They were like not just nail people. They were like friends, you know. And they, their family used to cook meals for us sometimes because we really liked the, the grandmother's cooking. She would make um, uh, uh, coconut curry. Back then I, I did eat meat, so she would make coconut chicken curry and the taste was amazing, but they would make us that and then they would have kimchi. Kimchi kind of has a kick of spice to it, which I'm not a fan of the spice. However, um, it is really good for helping to maintain weight and it's definitely good for a probiotic effect. If I can get this open. Finally. Okay, there we go. So I just want to try this on camera with y'all just to see if I like it. I'm not sure that I will and I'm not going to make up the taste once I taste it. Okay, it smells like kimchi. <laughs> I'm going to take a fork and try this while I'm looking at y'all. I don't know why I feel so grossed out. I think it's because it looks so spicy. I don't know. Let's just see. Wow. That's spicy. Wow. Wow. It tastes like kimchi. It tastes like what I used to eat back in the day, the kimchi. I'm not gonna lie, it's, it's good, I can eat it. However, is it really? Now I'm having mixed feelings. Is it really spicy? Because once you swallow it, your mouth don't feel as spicy. But yeah, it's a go. I would buy this brand over again. I bought two of them, so I have two of them. So I probably will have some kimchi tomorrow. There we go. Probably have some kimchi tomorrow. But yeah, kimchi is a vibe. And that's the vegan version, so if you guys are interested, I'm just saying. But yeah, my weight is really like, it's been, I've been like 155, 156 a lot. I've been fluctuating. This morning I woke up at 157.2 pounds and I think that's just because I had a lot of waste in my body. I needed to detox. I had not been having successful bowel movements like that regularly. Um, maybe like once a day or every other day, whatever. It just wasn't, I needed to put some things in my body that I knew would bring it out, which again, I had the detox coffee. I had the detox green smoothie today. I've been drinking green um, pressed juice. Like I had a salad. So I knew all that stuff will make me get on the toilet about three times today. And it did. So I'm hoping I go one more time before I go to bed. So that could be like a fourth time to kind of flush out my system. And I'll be drinking water, like I said, for the rest of the day. And what else? Yeah, so tomorrow I'm thinking I probably will wake up and I'll weigh like 155, maybe even 154 because I feel like, okay, 154 is pushing it. I feel like it's a possibility for me to wake up and be 156 or 155. Um, definitely 156, but maybe 155 because like I said, I flushed out a lot today. Um, the goal by November 1st is to be at 149 pounds. To be quite frank though, I would like to be at like 153, 152 by Monday. Um, it's very possible that's a week from now. And then, well less than a week. And then by the end of that next week, hopefully be in the 140s or 150, 151. So I'm gonna really be focused on what's going in. Like I said, when I go to the grocery store, I'm gonna go to my farmer's market probably tomorrow or Friday when I go there. I'm gonna probably pick up more of these until I get my juicer. I probably pick up about maybe four of these or five just to have them on hand at home. So when I'm done, um, obviously I make green smoothies, but whenever I'm not making a smoothie and I want a green juice, that they do have different flavors of the juice. So tomorrow I think I'm gonna pick up all the other flavors. They have like beet juice, I think. I think they have carrot juice. I've seen a few different ones before. So I'm gonna see if they have them tomorrow or whenever I go back up there. I'm gonna get my cucumbers. I'm gonna write my list out because one thing I don't like is when I off the cuff grocery shop because I feel like if I had a list, it would be more arranged as to what I need and not to oversupply things and then not to cut myself short on how I can make this meal 
out of multiple things with those ingredients so we will see um what else yeah so really weight is on the top of my list right now business goals and cleanup all of that is on the top of the list as well as you guys know um i've been just taking stages of my house to clean um because it does get overwhelming to do everything in one minute like or, or one day you know because i'd be so have so many things going on that sometimes it's like not realistic so i'm gonna get some work done today i'm gonna go pull out my planner so i can start writing out some goals grab my laptop i'm not guys i'm not gonna promise you that this video is gonna be uploaded tonight nor my other videos that were filmed today simply because i need to figure some things out on my computer right now and the uploading from my camera would have to go onto the computer and that would have to all come back to is there going to be you know like can i get it uploaded can i edit because there's some things that i just need to do and figure out on my computer as to why i've been having errors and then hopefully i'll be able to drag everything edit upload the videos for you guys if um this is not uploaded tonight like i said i'll try my hardest to make sure it's uploaded this week there are literally some things that i need to get that are on my wish list but there are some things that i need to get that are on my to-do list and that are needs and not they're definitely necessities so make sure you guys give this video a big thumbs up like comment share subscribe let me know um if you guys are liking my videos what do you guys want to see do you like when i do beauty do you like when i do fashion fitness what we are going to be sculpting this body y'all so this body is about to go back to goals you feel me I'm about to get back on my workouts like I used to do. I mean, it's been about a month and a half that I actually worked out, worked out because I had given myself a workout break because I had overworked my body. I did the 40 days and 40 commitment, the 40 days and 40 night commitment to myself, which basically was me working out every single day, working on my businesses and things like that. It was about commitment. And I felt like because I did 40 days in a row of fitness, I kind of overworked my body. So i decided that month two month and a half i was going to just focus on what i was putting in my body and not really focus on the app the fitness aspect but i am going to get back into my running and my walking just simply because those do a lot for me especially at the start of my day and hit workouts are really good for weight loss and what else yeah because i'm about 155 typically um, when I'm not that 172, 157 bloat, I'm about 155 now. I'll fluctuate between 155 and 154. So I'm still about 20 something pounds away from hitting the 120s again. And your girl is motivated. Okay. I'm sorry, y'all. There was actually no definition cut when I just did that. But I know y'all ain't going to judge me. Period. But no, y'all. Ooh, child, I'm tired. I be wearing my own self out. I know y'all worn out. These greens just seem like they're opening up my nasal passage. And it's probably the mint. Now, mind you, I sneeze maybe off camera sometimes because mint makes me sneeze after so long of drinking it. But there's mint in there. But if I have mint in water, yeah, your girl's probably going to go on a sneeze attack, but I still consume water with mint. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This was just like a update, you know, kind of what's going to be going on in my life. Make sure you guys shop my Poshmark clo closet. Make sure you guys smash the subscribe button. Go follow me on Instagram. My main account is at Kralisa Victoria, spelled the same way as my YouTube channel. And all of my subsequent accounts are in the bio. So I will see you beautiful people in the next video. Drink your green drink, sis. Stay out the people business. Mind your business. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Okay. See ya.